hello everyone in this video i will be briefly talk about lymphatic drainage of reproductive systems now i have done it in uh, uh, in my series of female anatomy but again i will go exclusively for lymph node drainage uh, before discussing the carcinomas so let's discuss it's very easy start with the vagina vagina is divided into three parts the lower one third middle one third and upper one third upper one third vagina is coexisting with the cervix so the lymphatic drainage of upper one third vagina and the cervix will be same now lower vagina drain into superficial inguinal lymph node remember superficial inguinal lymph node the middle one third drain in the internal iliac lymph node remember middle one third internal iliac lymph node the upper one third of vagina along with cervix along with the body of uterus will drain into external iliac lymph node now it is becoming easy superficial inguinal lymph node lower one third vagina middle one third vagina internal iliac lymph node upper one third vagina with cervix with body of uterus goes to external iliac lymph node now let's talk with the upper part here the fundus of the uterus along with the lateral part of fallopian tube this is the lateral part of fallopian tube along with ovary all the over drain into para aortic lymph node remember para aortic lymph node this yellow circle i have shown you this part drains in a different lymph node that is external iliac lymph node why because the round ligament origins from here and ends into into the into the labia majora so where the labia majora drains external iliac lymph node along with lower one third vagina so external iliac lymph node drains what the cornu of the uterus the round ligament and the middle part of this fallopian tube and also ovarian ligament so it's very easy to remember all these things thank you friends